Mitch McCoy, as we learn, the Arkansas Attorney General has opened an investigation into Liberty Utilities. Mitch? Yeah, Bob and Laura, good evening to you guys. In addition to the Arkansas Attorney General, earlier today the Arkansas Public Service Commission put Liberty Utilities on notice with this letter right here. It's ordering the utility company to provide a written report no later than Thursday about the steps the water company has taken to identify the cause of the leaks or loss of water pressure. More on this in just a moment. But first, these inquiries come hours after a public meeting between the governor and leaders in Pine Bluff. The city's mayor called the issue, quote, a catastrophic situation and says some residents have not been able to take showers because the water pressure is so low. Governor Asa Hutchinson calls the issue in Jefferson County a significant problem. My biggest concern is that uh, you know, Liberty advises that uh, they've been able to find leaks within a couple of days in other uh, places, but here we're three or four days into it and they've not identified the significant leaks in the system. Non-emergency surgeries at Jefferson Regional Medical Center have been canceled and patients have been asked to use medical waste bags instead of toilets. Back to that order from the Arkansas Public Service Commission. They want to know what Liberty Utilities plan is to restore reasonable, safe, adequate, and sufficient service to customers. The commission also wants to see a copy of its emergency operations plan. Again, this is all due by to the state by noon on Thursday. Laura.